Hi everyone. Okay, again with the LG Tone 700. Um, one of the other things that happens a lot on this on the 700 and 730 is that the design of this is that the wires are exposed on the outer side of the ring. And as you can see, because if you wear it a lot, um, it'll be there'll be abrasions from due to your clothes, and eventually the wires will be exposed. And um, as of my, for mine, it stopped working as of yesterday. I had a pretty good year run, and um, it stopped working. But um, basically, I saw a fix on YouTube, and it seems like it works pretty well. Um, I did it for my left. So um, on the fix um, is by this guy Jim. I'll leave his link down there. Um, not to take any credit away from him. Um, I watched his video, and you know he. Did great. So I'm not going to show you what he did. He actually has the soldering and everything down. The only thing is that when he did it, he did it in a silent fast frame mode. So a lot of people were asking questions. Um, he's also very skilled with an exacto knife. So um, uh, he did it with this, these tools. He did it with a paint stir. They're free from Home Depot. One of these 99 cent exacto knives. And of course, he had. Um, you have to have a um, basic. That's what he showed, and of course you have to have a soldering gun, a solder, right? But um, when he started prying this open, what he did not show everyone is that um, here, if you can show show it to you here, you see this hole. It's actually you see a rubber plug in here. You have to actually pry that open with one of those small um, screwdrivers. Um, I have these small screwdrivers from repairing my iPhones. You can get these um, thing under like iPhone repair kit at um, Amazon.com. I'll leave a link also. It's about dollar fifty, and free shipping. But you have to have twenty five dollars, of course, to have that free shipping. Or you could go to DX.com. I'll find a link. I'll put it in my video as well. And um, they have free shipping all the time. The con to that is that um, they have. The ship, it's all usually, well, it's 100% shipped from either China or Hong Kong, so it takes two weeks to get to the United States. Um, free shipping, though. And um, I'll put those links on anyway. So that will give you the screwdriver. Or you can just go to um, any place in like a 99 cent store or a Home Depot, which was sort of more expensive. This is a size zero Phillips head. You need that to remove the screws once you take the plug out. Remove the screws. Now, <clears throat> the kit also come with um, these plastic, like like little um, pries that you know you can pry the stuff open. The guy who did this on his video, he used an exacto knife and he went along the edges slowly. He opened it up. The thing with that is that you might cut into the plastic if you're not very good with it, and then you know as you pry it, you leave little marks, like little jagged marks. Um, <clears throat> what I did, I didn't have that, so um, but I play the guitar, so I have these. Guitar picks, and I use a guitar pick. Plastic is good on plastic. And as you pry it open, if you as you pry it open slowly, and I did that already here. Um, you will see that. Um, I should have too much light in the back, but here is. Let's see, there we go. Here is that screw, uh, where the screw goes in, and here is the the part where it's being exposed. So what he did is, um, it's held together actually by this little, they tie a little knot here. And what he did was he cut it, and then he actually resoldered it to the back over here. And then he held it down with a glue gun. Um, if you don't have it, you could use it um, you know, to hold everything together. Basically, to hold everything in place, and instead of tying another knot and wasting more length, he held this down with a glue gun, um, which is a great idea. Or you can use electrical tape, that doesn't matter. Um, that's all I have to say. Basically, um, you'll see, I'm sure if, since I'm here, see the four clips. There's actually one, two, and one, and I broke this one on this side. But then again, he also used um, a little dab of glue gun to hold it down. I mean, there's something you could do if you, you know, you're a hobbyist, you know, or you, you like to play with this. It's not a hard fix, but, you know, you're going to have to spend a little time with soldering. And um, the LG 700 right now, I saw it on Amazon. The real ones. Because I saw a lot of fakes, um, they're about 45 you know, 50 bucks, you know, and if you want to play with it, it's actually pretty good. It's not that expensive to buy anymore. The 700, 730 all work great. I think the 800, um, I, I actually bought it, returned it, um, because at first it's pretty expensive, it's over $100. And second, there's no difference. And I still think the 700 rocks in distance, and the 730 also for its price is great, and it's one of the better ones out there. 
and um, there's a couple of designs I didn't like about the 800 is that um, instead of being round it's actually long so it hangs over your shoulder which makes it hard to put under your clothes sometimes because you know already this is like around is actually the closest you can get now if it's over your shoulder then it's got to go outside your collar if I wear a shirt and it's kind of uncomfortable but they did they did fix this flaw now it comes from the inside loop out of a hard plastic the hard plastic part is actually longer now and the, the, the line comes from the inside so you won't have this problem but then again it's not that hard of a fix you need a pair of scissors to cut this and provided that your your disconnect is it's somewhere here let's say if it's up here you know you ripped you pulled it and you yanked it and the rip is here then fixing this won't work and you'll notice that you know of course before you put it back try it you could you know if you have a tester it'd be great but if you don't you could keep cutting it you know <laughs> shorter and shorter and eventually you'll find the part where it's having a problem. Um, but um, this is only to do with if you have spare times on your, spare time on your hands, and you know. So that's that. So remember, there's a there's a screw, and um, I wouldn't recommend the X-Acto knife. Uh, I probably go to get a guitar pick or buy one of those kits for a dollar something on Amazon. Alrighty. Okay. Hope this helps. Uh, hope this helps. All right.